Unlocking the meaning of get acknowledged. Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. We're going to explore the phrase get acknowledged, a commonly used expression in the English language. Understanding this phrase is key to mastering the nuances of English communication. So, let's dive in and uncover its meaning and usage. Get acknowledged is a phrase that combines the verb get with the past participle acknowledged. It generally means to receive recognition or confirmation for something. This could be for an action, a skill, an achievement, or even an opinion. In simpler terms, it's when someone notices and appreciates what you have done or said. To better understand, get acknowledged. Let's look at some examples. 1. In the workplace, after working overtime for weeks, Jake finally got acknowledged by his manager for his hard work. 2. In personal relationships, Sarah got acknowledged by her friends for her talent in painting. 3. In academic settings, he got acknowledged for his innovative research in the science fair. These examples show that, get acknowledged, can be used in various contexts where someone's efforts or ideas are recognized by others. Understanding synonyms can deepen our grasp of the phrase. Some synonyms for, get acknowledged, include, be recognized, be appreciated, receive credit, gain acknowledgement. Each of these phrases carries a similar meaning but may be used slightly differently based on the context. When using, get acknowledged, be aware of these common mistakes. 1. Wrong tense usage. Avoid using the wrong tense. It's, got acknowledged, not, gets acknowledged, in past events. 2. Misinterpreting the meaning. Remember, it's about receiving recognition, not about acknowledging others. 3. Overuse. Use this phrase appropriately and avoid overusing it in situations where a simple, thank you, or, well done, would suffice. We hope this video has helped you understand the phrase, get acknowledged, in English. Remember, learning a language is all about understanding the small nuances that make it rich and expressive. Keep practicing, and don't hesitate to use, get acknowledged, in your conversations to sound more like a native speaker. See you in the next video, and happy learning!